Hey everybody, I am back and I'm gonna show you how I am going to be juicing. I'm gonna show you how I use my Cousinart um, compact juice extractor and the fruits and vegetables that I will be juicing. So the first thing I'm gonna be doing is, oh, I guess I'm gonna start with carrots because it's like the basic and it's the, the easiest thing to do. So I'm gonna use I'm carrots. I'm using um, blackberries. I'm gonna be using um, baby mini cucumbers. I'm gonna be using limes. I'm gonna be using mangoes. Cantaloupe. And these are blueberries. Clementines. I'm gonna be using apples. Raspberries. And I'm gonna be using celery. And it's exactly 16 ounces. 16 ounces. Now I'm gonna close this and I'm gonna turn off my machine. There you go, 16 ounces. And this is my celery. And in the back, look at all the pulp. Now I'm gonna be going, moving on to my mini cucumbers. Now we're gonna use the, the mini cucumbers. Okay, so now we're gonna do carrots. I already washed the carrots, which I used a, a brush right here to scrub. Um, this is the brush that I'm gonna be using to scrub the vegetables and the fruits. And also, I'm gonna be using this brush to clean the blade from here so that I don't have to use my hands and I, don't, I won't have to hurt myself or cut myself because the blade is very sharp. So this is what I'm gonna be using to clean the blade. And um, I cut the ends, as you can see, I cut the ends to each of the carrots and I'm ready to um, extract the juice.
And that's it. Now, I'm gonna show you something, um, the pulp. Now, I just wanna make um, a quick reminder, do not throw away the, the pulp for the carrots because you might be able to use it for carrot cakes or um, muffins or, you know, stuff like that. So it's good sometimes not to throw away the pulp. So like I said, when it comes to the carrot pulp, do not throw it away because you could use it for um, desserts. Now for the apples, this is how I cut them. I already um, scrubbed them, I washed them with um, cold water and some soap using um, this brush right here. Now you take the, the um, apple, sorry, and I cut it like almost in the center like that and I keep cutting around it and I get rid of this I do not um, use this at all and now I'm gonna continue to do the rest of the apples and then I'm gonna show you how I do it. okay so now I'm gonna show you how I use the apple God, it looks so good. You know what I was thinking also, guys? That this is really good for my grandson, too, for babies. Like, if you're starting to give them um, juice, this is a great way to introduce them to natural juice. So my grandson, he just turned 11 months. And I plan to go visit him and really soon. And um, I'm thinking this is really good for my grandson too. So I can introduce him to, um, to apple juice and carrot juice and all that. Okay, so it's done. Now I'm gonna pour in the apple juice. And notice I pour, I used, um, I did not peel the apple. And there you go. And there you go. I'm going to put this in the refrigerator along with the other juices. Now the next thing I'm going to be using is a mandarin. Now we're going to be using the mandarin. And that's it. It reached 16 ounces. I still have, I still have some um, more left over here, which Aura and I are gonna start drinking right now. We're gonna drink it in a cup, <laughs> but this one I'm gonna be putting in a bottle right here. Oops. And there you go. There you go, Mandarin. And like I said, well, I'm gonna continue to do this one here. I'm gonna these that are left over and Aura and I are gonna enjoy it right now. So here's Aura enjoying a glass of Clementines. I, I kept saying Mandarin and <laughs> I meant to say Clementines. So how is it Aura? It's taste good. it yeah. <laughs> she already tasted it off camera it's good right 
And you give this a one or two thumbs up? Two. A two thumbs up? Yeah, two. All right, there you go. Freshly um, squeezed or extracted yeah. clementine juice. Okay, now I'm gonna be using for the very last bottle that I have here for the last bottle. I am going to be using uh, raspberries, blackberries, um, mangoes, cantaloupe, and I'm gonna mix everything up um, and put it all together in one bottle. Okay, so cantaloupe first. <laughs> the blackberries the blackberries and I'm going to be using the um, raspberries And the blueberries. Oops, some of them got away. <laughs> now these are mangoes. Oh my god, it smells so good, guys. Oh my goodness. It smells so good. Now, I ran out. As you can see, I don't have any more. So what I'm going to do is I am going to add some water um, to the bottle. I'm going to turn this off. Oh my god, I wish you could smell this. I wish you could smell it. Oh my god. It smells so good, guys. Oh, I wish you could smell it. So I'm gonna add all the ingredients in here. Look at how beautiful it looks. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> and that's it. And then I'm just gonna add um, water to it. Cause I didn't have enough. I should get more. I'm gonna get more. Now I know how to get more. So, oh, and another thing. When you um, store each juice or veg, you know, for, uh, fruit or vegetable juice, make sure that you fill it up all the way to the top or if if in my case i didn't have enough it didn't fill up the bottle you just fill up the rest all the way up with water or you can use another option that you can use is coconut water you can use coconut water so let me wash my hands oh my goodness this one right here i think it's my favorite it smells so so good i'm gonna clean it up And get this out of the way. It's I'll clean up the mess later. Um, and there you go. This is my mixed fruit. This is the this one right here is the um, apple. The apple. And then this one's right here is the carrot. This is the cucumber. And this is the celery juice. And this right here is the clementine. So I'm going to put these in the refrigerator. And this is what I'm going to be drinking throughout the day for day one. Okay. What I'm going to plan on doing is I'm going to do, I'm going to prepare my juices at five o'clock in the morning. First thing in the morning before I start my day. Every day at five o'clock in the morning, I'm going to prepare my juices. I'm going to be, of course, I'm going to be um, using different types of vegetables, different types of um, of um fruits and stuff like that i'll mix i'll mix like i did with um this one right here 
once in a while I will mix. I'll mix it up so that I won't get bored. And um, But you get the idea. And I'll be drinking um, two in the morning, two for lunch. This is breakfast, lunch, and this is dinner. And throughout the day, I'm going to be drinking plenty of water. Now, throughout the day, between the juicing, I am going to be, like in the morning, first thing in the morning, I'm going to um, drink um, a cup full of water. I like to keep this on my nightstand next to my bed. So first thing in the morning, I will remind myself to drink water. So I'm gonna, um, this, I'm gonna show you what I, what I use. Um, I will take, which I already pre-cut. I took um, lemon, you could use lemon or limes. In my case, I'm gonna be using lime. So I'm gonna be using um, all these lemons. Hopefully it'll fill, it'll fill up a cup of, um, of lime juice now I've, I'm sorry I forgot to mention you use two lemons two to three lemons so this is my um, oops this is my um, third lemon okay so I used three lemons and I'm gonna pour it in here and this is what I'm gonna be drinking throughout the day okay I will start drinking this at 5 a.m. Just when I get up to prepare the juices. 5 o'clock. That's my schedule. You, Of course, you work around your schedule. You know, when do you wake up? That's the question. When do you first get up? Like, before you even put your feet on the ground. As soon as you wake, put your head up, that's when you wake up. So I'm going to fill it up to the rim right there. So that's basically um, two and a half bottles, which is how many ounces? Um, 16 ounces each. You can even, you can even um, use, yeah, three bottles of 16 ounces. But for ounces. now, 32 ounces, right, all together, 32 ounces. Thank you, Aura. But for now, this is what I'm going to show you as an example. And I'm going to throw in, um, let me put some water in here. So when you wake up, you drink one cup of water lemon juice okay water with some lemon juice and then you could go on and proceed you know proceed to go on to your day i like to add some lemon or lime pieces in here and then i just um replace the water you see and that makes it exactly three bottles of water which comes out to aura oh, no idea. 16 ounces wait 40 28 i think Okay, so I use three bottles of water, 16 ounces each, and I fill it up. And this is uh, what I'm going to be drinking throughout the day. Um, like I said, I start at 5 o'clock in the morning, and I keep this on my bedside. I fill up a cup, and then I replace the cup of water that um, I took out. I replace this here with the rest of the water like I did here. And then I proceed to drink two um, bottles um, of either fruits or vegetables in the morning then I drink water again I drink another cup of water and then I get I drink two bottles of the fruit or vegetables for lunch then I drink some more water throughout the day and then I finish up for dinner time I drink the two last bottles and then right before I go to bed I drink another cup of water lemon uh, lemon juice and water I drink another cup of water so then at night with my last cup of water I refill and I start all over again like I did in the beginning and that's how what I plan on doing I, I am going to be juicing and I'm going to be drinking plenty of water throughout the day so um, I just wanted to share with you what I'm going to be doing this is my first day Actually, I already started. Um, this is my. I just wanted to show you how I prepared, how I prepare, how I start. Uh, basically, um, whether it's two, three, four, five, you're into the month already of doing this. Um, you just. This is just an idea of what the recipe to use. You know, you can always mix and match. You know, like like mix your fruits and vegetables and stuff like that, which I'm going to be showing you. Uh, in my other video, my next videos, I'm going to be showing you what I continue to do throughout 
my future um, juicing, you know, my future days or throughout the month, I'll show you. But this is just basically so you could get an idea of what I am going to be doing and how I store it. Now, this goes inside the refrigerator. Now, like I said, it's very important that you fill it up to the rim. And if you only made 16 ounces of juice, then fill up the rest with coconut water or um, water. It's very important that you fill it up to the rim and tighten it because it's going to start fermenting. And um, you need to consume this right away. This is why I do this daily. I like to drink it fresh and I like to prepare it fresh. So every day I am going to put it in my mind that at 5 o'clock in the morning, this is what I'm going to do. This is going to be my daily routine every day. Um, you can, this is good for up to three days in the refrigerator, but I personally like it fresh. Okay. Um, it starts fermenting and if you don't fill it up, it will explode. Like if you pop it, boom, it'll explode. Um, and it'll taste bad. So it's best if you fill it up to the rim. And like I said, if you didn't fill it up with, a, with enough juice, then you just replace it with coconut water or regular water. Fill it up to the rim, like I showed you in the video. And that's it. Put it in the refrigerator. Do not freeze it. Put it in the refrigerator and you're good to go. And that's it, guys. I just wanted to show you how I prepare, how I store, and what I plan on doing. This is just to give you an idea. But it's very important, like I said, it's very, very important that you drink water throughout the day. And I like to add um, lemon or lime, like I said, because it gives it a little flavor. And also this, the lime or the lemon mixed with the water helps with it, your digestion and it will help you lose weight like really, really quick. I, in three days, I can lose 10 pounds if I put my mind to it. Three days, three to four days, I will lose 10 pounds. I've already lost um, five pounds on this, okay? I already lost five pounds. I'm on my third day already. Um, I lost five pounds already, so I'm doing good. All right, guys, so that's it. Thank you so much. Have a great day. I love you and besitos. I wish them a, a blessed day, a wonderful day. Hey, babe, give me a subscribe. Oh, you want them to subscribe? But don't.